Okay, so let's try this half, uh, half-life equation. So remember, half-lives are um, first-order uh, rate uh, equations, okay? So if you um, subject this to the first-order rate law, you should be able to get the right answer. So this one says, a half-life of cobalt-60 is 5.3 years. How much of a 1.00 mix sample of cobalt-60 is left after a 10 year period. Okay, so um, the first thing we're going to have to do is figure out what is the K of this equation. Okay, so well I guess remember the uh, first order integrated rate law is the ln of the concentration of A0 divided by concentration of AT equals KT. <laughs> so in this case, um, uh, concentration of A naught is going to be um, the original mass, okay? And the, con the mass at time t is actually what we're looking for. So this would be integrated rate law um, for the rate equation with concentrations, we're going to use this for um, the half-life of one of these radioactive isotopes, so we'll just change this to m naught and mt there, okay? So we have T, we have m naught, we're looking for mt, we don't know what that is, so what do we have to find? K first, okay? So for uh, uh, first order rate uh, equation, remember K is the ln of 2 divided by, in the case of uh, half-life, it's going to be the half-life there, okay? So, That's going to give us a value k that equals 0 0.131 per year. Okay? Is everybody okay with what we've done so far? Yes. Okay. So we're looking for mt. This is m naught. So m at time t. So we can uh, change this around to make it easier for us to solve. So remember, ln of m naught divided by mt is going to change to ln, if we're going to expand it, of m naught minus the ln of mt equals kt, like that. Okay? So we again want to solve for mt, so let's isolate the ln of mt now, okay? So ln of mt is going to equal the ln of m0 minus kt, like that. Is everybody okay with that? Yes. So now, how do we get rid of ln? We gotta take it to the e, everything to the e, okay? So we'll take both sides to the e. Both sides to the e. Like that. So when we do e to the ln, that cancels out like that. So that's gonna give us a new equation. I'll just write it up here. So too tall to That's mt equals e ln of m naught minus k. Okay. Can I erase this portion down here? Yes. Is everybody okay with that? Do you get this one? 
Yes. Okay, so that's what we're looking for is MT. So all we need to do is really plug in values for this, okay? So MT equals E to the LN of, well, 1.000 minus K 0.13. Per year times t, which is 10.6 years. Okay. Is everybody okay with what we've done there? Yes. So if you solve for that, you should get the answer. So that number times 10.6, and then say, well, the ln of 1, of course, is 0. So it's going to be um, negative 1.3. Eight. And we're going to say E to that number. And to 366, we get 0 0.250 milligrams. Okay, so that's the long way to do this. Like you're doing it like a um, uh, first order rate equation, okay, integrated first order rate equation. Any question, questions on this one? No. Okay. Let's do it the, the faster way now. Okay, we'll do the same problem really quick. Though. 